Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's that boy G playing. Don't give a damn. He cooler than the fan. Walking real tall. Some say he's man. At the time, he didn't really know how to deliver it like he wanted it, wanted to. He knew what he wanted to say, but he didn't know how he wanted to deliver it. Mm -hmm. So me and my little partner, Dino Danger, who I was in the group with, we were like, walk him through it, come up with shit for him, help him through it, you know what I'm saying? I ain't shit pay, pissed the babe in about six days. Mm -hmm. I was, yeah, I was there when that got created. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't, the shit that I could speak on is like, I never, I'm, you know, I'm 17, 18, 19 years old at the time. I don't really, you know what I'm saying? Man, I'm telling you some, some crazy shit. Because I met the nigga who was selling the drink, I started selling drink. I didn't know nothing about drink, right? Mm -hmm. This nigga cutting the drink with Cairo. He ain't giving me paints. He giving me the drink and baby bottles. I never knew it came in paints. Dang. All right, fast forward. I ever go to the hospital from somebody selling him cut drink. Mm -hmm. They can't remember where they got it from. My name come up that it might have came from me. Mm -hmm. Man, the nigga called me to the house uh, in the bricks on 17. Lock me in that motherfucker and then I almost killed me in that bit one time because they thought I was cutting the drink. Ooh. Ken Yaka, rest in peace his soul. He knew what kind of nigga I was. You know what I'm saying? I had been around them niggas. Yeah, I, man, Ivy was such a good hearted nigga and was so, such a baller. Man, this nigga had a, a room full of throwbacks. Anybody from our section could go in that bitch and get whatever you want. When we go into the club, everybody got a throwback on. And he... You know, we, back then we wore shit, um, tall tees, yeah. extra large, yeah. so everything was one it, one size fit all. Yeah. Everybody wear the same size, big shit, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So it's just nothing but throwbacks, hats. Man, hoes used to pass by the block on the Yang and 17th and the top just because we out there looking like we on a cash money video. Like, them, like that's what's the thing to do. Like, man, we gonna pass by them niggas block cause them niggas out there with it. Yeah. And they got that shit on. Yeah. Niggas look like the squad out there. You know what I'm saying? That's the kind of, that, that, but that's because that's the energy I ever had in the hood. Like, it was so much money floating through that bitch, you had to be getting some money. You know what I'm saying? But fast forward, they locked me in the house. Yeah, King Yaka, he like, Man, A1 ain't do that shit. I know A1 ain't cut that drink. He like, man, where you getting that shit from, Will? I'm like, man, it's a nigga from Shreveport, bro. He like, man, hey, I was like, man, you got to call that nigga down here right now. I'm like, shit, I ain't tripping. I jumped on the phone. I'm like, say, man, whatever you been doing to that drink, my people hot, you know, bring your ass down here. You feel me? Yeah. So um, he like, who that is? I'm like, man, that's Ivan, man. He like, the bird, man? I'm like, yeah. He like, oh, I'm coming. Like, the nigga kept it all the way G with me. He could have and been like, I ain't got nothing to do with you. Little. he way in Shreveport? No, he lived, he was, going, he was going to Southern. Oh, okay. He, he lived down here. He was just a, he was a, he was a street nigga going to school. Yeah. And nigga ran his finesse now. I'm talking about this nigga dangerous. This nigga turned Baton Rouge upside down. I told you it was Jigga City. Yeah. The bitch had drink, bars, tabs, perks, all the downers. That shit started right then and there. Boo, Boo, Boosa used to be hot because he, he only wanted to fuck with the drink. I started taking bars. Lil Fat them come up under me. Remember Lil Fat them on bars. I retired from the bars, now I'm taking tab. That's because we a product of our environment. I, if I probably never took a bar, a lot of niggas probably never took a bar down here, my nigga. Niggas probably still be popping jiggers. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you some real shit. You feel me? So, fast forward, the nigga... I can't say his name. My people, he come, he man, that nigga, that nigga came to the top in the bricks on 17 and whipped up. That nigga jumped out. Him and Ivy walked up the block, talked. You know what I'm saying? He came back. He, him and Ivy both talked to him. He say, um, my people told me he was like, she, Ivy gonna just be dealing with me from now on. You know what I'm saying? He was like. And I ain't gonna give you no more than baby bottles. I'm finna put you on. You know what I'm saying? So whatever I ever had and told him made him come back and fuck with me straight up. And we've been locked in ever since. You know what I'm saying? Damn. You feel me? Yeah. That's that's a story like in itself.